So today, um, I'm in Naturalizer and they're having their holiday event. So I'm gonna check out some of the shoes. I, re I already own two Naturalizer boots because they do wide cap boots. So I'm gonna check out some stuff, look around, do my thing. You know how I do. Look at the bloggy boo lids. Happy holidays. Yes, look, she got a drink in her hand. <laughs> I'm gonna get me one too. <laughs> it was the night before Christmas. So I'm gonna try on the leopard heels that I picked up. <laughs> You know I can't with this. I'm trying to stop with the leopard, but it's like, oh, these are so cute. So let's see how they fit. Oh, and also this naturalizer I'm at is on West 34th Street, and they carry wide width and wide, uh, wide width and wide cap in store. <laughs> I, I can I can fake it yeah, 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 with those jeans. Wait, what's your belt? Um, the boots. They were What's up, guys? So today, I am headed to the um, hair salon so I can get a little wash and um, refresh on my curls. So um, I'm gonna go see Courtney, and I think that's about all I'm doing today because I'm expecting some packages, um, furniture. For the living room we're giving it a little upgrade so that's what we're doing today and today is friday all right guys so i made it to courtney's i just sat under that dryer for like hours <laughs> um so she uh just blew it out because i know a couple of you have asked like you know how to how to maintain this so at home she told me to use a conditioner when it gets tangled because this hair gets tangled and to use a wide tooth comb to comb it out so the pattern of this hair is naturally curly anyway so she just washed and blue dried me out blow dried me out and so now she's gonna curl it. Yeah, I was blued out. I try to be careful with that because I said I don't want to get caught up. <laughs> My mama be so mad. <laughs> so anyway, she's about to curl it. Um, and I'll show you guys maybe like two or three curls that she does. But yeah, this is basically a close up of how the hair looks. All right, guys, I just want you to see how she curls it. So as you can see, it's already, the texture's there, so it's already a little wavy. And so now she's gonna curl it with a Marcel curling iron. But she uses it like a, a curling wand opposed to a regular curling iron. Can you see it? Is that the? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Oh, see, she wraps it around tightly, and then she just holds it, she said, for a minute. But my arms be tired. <laughs> <laughs> and then she lets it cool. And then she drops it. Bam! Can you show them in the back for me? Yes. Right. <laughs> yep, yeah, see? So that's how she gets the curls. Ooh, those are pretty. Mm -hmm. And they last a long time. And so they last a long time. So the first time she did it, I literally had those curls in my hair for a little over a week. I would just put a bonnet on and um, I would pin the, my leave out so I didn't have to curl my leave out. So, cause I know one of you asked about that, like, do I have to keep curling the leave out? I, I don't play that with the curling too much because I mean, I don't want my hair to break off. So I just pin it up and just put a hair bonnet on and that's how I keep the curls. But the good thing about this hair is that it looks better the older it gets. So when the curls drop, it's a whole different complete, it's a completely different hairstyle. And then when it starts getting too raggedy because I'm not taking care of it anymore, I can put it in a ponytail and it still looks cute because the ponytail looks nice and wavy. So anyway, so that that's how it goes. That's how my boo Courtney does. She kills it. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, so for those of you who asked, I just showed you. All right, so now she's gonna curl the rest and um, I'll see you guys later. 
Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It's hump day. So today I am filming some videos. I just got through doing my hair and makeup. Let me tell you guys why I really like love this hair. Because I literally just put a bonnet on, tuck the curls under, take the bonnet off, shake it out, put a little oil for frizz, and I'm ready to go. Anyway, so today we are filming. Um, so I I'm doing a uh, sponsored video with Boohoo. They sent me um, some really cute pieces. You guys will probably have seen the video by now, or maybe not, you know, cause they have to approve the video and give me their feedback, which is why sometimes, like, especially in the beginning, um, especially when I first started my YouTube channel, I wasn't really keen on doing a lot of sponsored stuff because the process of a sponsored video is a pain in the butt. So a brand could be like, oh, we don't like the lighting. Like, oh, we don't like the background. Oh, you know, they have so much critique and it's just like, I don't want to keep refilming these videos, you know? So now I've like figured out my lighting. I figured out everything. So a lot of the times the feedback I get is more so like, could you say this? Or could you, you know, add in a little wording at the bottom? So for me to fix it, it's much easier than having to refilm a video. Cause I did a video one time with Family Dollar. You know, I had to film that video twice. And this was earlier when I start, like I said, when I started uh, doing YouTube. And I was like, uh-uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Anyway, um, so I just hung everything up. I'm about to like space my hangers because I don't like when my hangers are like this. Uh, you know, my background is retail, so I definitely like to space my hangers right. Hello, and guys. <laughs> Hello there. Today is, what is today? Thursday. So I have a couple of events to go to today. Or is it one today? See, this is why you got to write stuff down. I have to look at my calendar. So, I am going to a Nordstrom event. Um, it's actually, uh, let me turn the water off so you guys can hear me. So, it's actually uh, an event because they're doing like a pop-up shop. And for the pop-up shop, they're actually going to include plus. So, they're having like this panel with some plus size influencers. And um, I was invited to go and attend. So um, I fell asleep with my makeup on last night. Big no-no. And so I'm taking it off <laughs> now. And I'm going to, because I have to put makeup back on later, I'm going to let my face breathe while I do a little bit of laundry. And then I have to edit a video for Boohoo because um, I'm doing another uh, sponsored video with them. And um, yeah, you know, that's what I'm going to do right now. Um... And then I'll figure out what I'm going to wear later. And I just ordered my Starbucks coffee. It's freezing outside. I didn't want to walk to go get it. But yeah, that's how my morning's going. <laughs> and to take my makeup off, I, I'll show you. So I had got this um, Pons, so I got makeup all over it now. So I had got this Pons cream uh, from the the Kohl's event I did, the lady who did my eyeshadow, she gave this to me. And I was like, wow, I haven't used a Pons cream in years. I wanna say like a decade. <laughs> so it actually comes in handy, it gets the makeup off. <laughs> so I'm just gonna finish up washing my face. You guys, so I had ordered the um, Kim Kardashian Skims Shapewear and the joints are too small. So mad, so mad. <laughs> so, but it's my fault because I tried to order them before but they were sold out. So when I got the email like, oh, they're back in stock, I, I didn't even go and read the size chart. I just took the size that I thought would fit, which was like a 2X, 3X. But unfortunately, they those are their sizing is different, so that didn't work out for sis. <laughs> um, so I have to return them. Um, I did not. I only tried on one thing, and the one thing I tried on, I'm keeping obviously. Um, but these I didn't try on, and and the reason why I know it doesn't fit is because when I was getting ready to try it on, it was just struggle mold to even get it past my thigh so i was like you know what let me just stop <laughs> um but i actually like the packaging i know some people didn't like the boxes that it came in but 
I, it, it, one of the um, shaper shorts came in this, but that shaper short I got, I don't know where it is right now. I got to find it. <laughs> that was like $98. And then I noticed the ones that are more lower price, which are the shaping underwear. And then another like, uh, I think it's called like um, a tummy shaper. Those were like 38 bucks and they came in these two things. So unfortunately out of the, what, one, two, three, four things I bought I'm returning three <laughs> bummer Hey guys, so I made it to the event and then I ran into my forever boo, my Maddie. <laughs> so for those of you who might not know, but you should know, this is the editor-in-chief of Plus Model Magazine. So all of the plus size models that you see, they came through her first. <laughs> so anyway, we're looking at the clothes um, and trying to do like a little shopping and stuff, but then we're like kind of catching up. So I'm gonna continue chatting with her and then I'll holler at you guys later. All right, so I'm looking through the stuff and they have some cute stuff. First of all, this skirt, this skirt right here is from Tanya Taylor. I need it. She just, I need that. And they also have, look at this blazer. This Tanya Taylor section. I need to go meet her. She's here. Oh, look at this metallic skirt. Oh my gosh. All of this is amazing. Good stuff. All right guys, so just finished the Nordstrom event. Um, so now I'm headed to the second event of the night and this is for the visual. Did I say that right? Dizzy is it the visual? Dizzy, dizzy wall. See? I'm like the visual. <laughs> Wrong and strong. And my partner in crime, Miss Sarah Curvely. You guys seen Curvely on here oh. before. <laughs> so we Ubered over here. All right, we're going to go in. She's doing her blogger work. Uh, yeah. You see? Like, this is real <laughs> live. I got to post before my time. So I don't want the brand to say nothing. <laughs> It was turning, it kept like, I don't know, Instagram, sometimes when I try to change the link in my bio, it'll give me a hard time. tonight i'm headed out to go meet up with my mom and have a little dinner with the family so um i'm bringing love love he always gets excited when he can come along to things like that so oh is that our uber all right i think our uber's here so i got love love with me <laughs> anywho yep so we're going to of all the places this lady wants to eat but i feel like people who live in different obviously live in different states in new york city they want to go to you know no new york city restaurants so she wants to go to bbq's now i haven't been to bbq's in years i remember back in the day that used to be the hot spot when i was a teenager especially the one on 42nd but i'm like you know what let's go i'll get some sticky wings or something but um all right, that, wait, is that the Uber now? I thought it was the Uber the first time, but it's not. I don't know why it's taking so long. Anyway, so I just did a little low-key face today. I just did foundation, lipstick, and mascara, which is pretty good. No blush. Did a little highlight, but you could barely see it. Anyway, where is this thing? All right, guys, so I made it to dinner where half of the fam is here. So that's my brother in law. He's a pain in the butt. You already know my sister. Those are all my cousins 
down there. Got no love, love. So um, I just ordered. I have. I hope everything still tastes good because I haven't been here in years. But we shall see. I also got me a little drink drink. I'm a one drink back you know. I'm definitely like, listen, if I do more than one drink, I'm losing. <laughs> anyway. Oh yeah, oh y'all know nephew already. Thank you. Well, I thought that was like Oh look, everybody say hi. <laughs> no, I leave, it leave it us alone. All right, let's get his shiny head. Shiny head. This bitch is a puppet. Come on, let's go. Guys, say my great niece. I'm a great auntie. Say hi, Laura. Come on, stop stealing a Laura shine. Back up. <laughs> say hi. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's up guys? Happy Friday. So today's Friday. So today is actually date day for me and my boo. We're gonna go to the movies to finally finally see Queen of Slim. And then after the movies, we're going to um uh grab some thing to eat. I want to go to the Olive Garden, but he's not like an Italian food lover. And I know you guys ask me all the time, like, why don't show him? He don't want to be seen. He's one of the people that does not have an Instagram. He doesn't have a Twitter, <laughs> nor a Facebook. So he's not into social media. And anytime I try to get close to him with a camera, he's like, anime bull up. <laughs> get that camera out of my face. <laughs> so yeah, so on date days, I like to dress down because he always sees me dressed up. So he likes when I give him my Brooklyn girl style. So I just got on like a gray hoodie today with some jeans and my sneakers. Yeah, so I just got on my sneakers and some jeans. Fanta, one small Fanta, one small Sprite. You want candy? All right, y'all. Yeah, so we decided to come to um, what is this place? The Olive Garden <laughs> to grab some lunch. It's funny because it's a little crowded in here, and it's like three o'clock. But um, I love Italian food, so that's why we're here. No, this is obviously not the best Italian food, but. They give you what you need when you can't get to the authentic Italian restaurant. <laughs> so, let's see what I'm going to get. So today I am headed out to the AJ Crimson Beauty event. Um, I was invited by their PR to come and check it out. So I'm just waiting for my Uber, which seems to be taking a really long time. I wish they hurry up. It's also super windy. So I had a um, photo shoot today and um, it was extremely windy. And um, it was kind of hard to get the shots that I wanted, but we powered through. <laughs> So I want this Uber to hurry the heck up. Come on, Uber. What's that? What's your people? Uh, three for 25. Three for 25? Yeah, three for 25. She said, let me pull out a minute. She said, let me pull out a minute. All right, guys. So I just got some new blush from Barbados. It's a Selassie. No, this is a Selassie brand. But the name of this palette is called Barbados. Look at these colors. They are amazing. So look, that's the pink. It looks amazing. Amazing. Yes. All right, guys, so 
this is what I'm wearing today. I have on the Eloquii red leather blazer with a black turtleneck jeans. And I just... <laughs> account of my outfit. Do you mind taking a photo though? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes, and this is Aisha. We go way back, y'all. <laughs> so I just have on these shoes from Aldell. I don't know if you guys can see. Well, she's gonna take my picture so you guys can see. <laughs> so today I have a couple of errands to run. So first thing on the list is I need to go downtown Brooklyn. So for those of you who don't know, I live in New York City. Um, Brooklyn all day every day <laughs> no um so I live in Brooklyn so I'm going downtown Brooklyn to one go to Sephora uh, I want to get the new NARS uh afterglow palette and plus I got a coupon I think it's like 25 off of 75 something like that and then um I want I have to go to the Lane Bryant downtown you know they're closing it down to all my New York watchers can you believe that they're closing down the Lane Bryant downtown it has been there for literally six, over 60 years. I think they said like 69 years it's been there. So they're closing it down. Um, and I need to go there because I'm actually doing a Instagram takeover with Lane Bryant. So I need to go in store and uh, get a few in store shots because it's supposed to be um, finding Christmas gifts under $50. So I need to go down in there and take some shots inside the store. And then after that, when I come back home, I got a new um, a new bookcase. So I need to take everything off the old bookcase, throw away the old bookcase, and then set up the new bookcase. And then after that, I have to do loads of laundry. <laughs> and then my super is supposed to be coming up. So that is what's on the list today. We're saying goodbye to Lane Bryant. I can't believe this. Look how empty this is. Look at the wall. That's my boo Stephanie. She made my kimono that I showed you guys yes. in my haul. Stephanie, Stephanie Allen Unlimited. Unlimited. She does custom kimonos. Order any length you want. I'll, I'll link her down below for you guys. Thanks, boo. <laughs> but look, guys, it's that's it. It's a wrap. for today so thank you guys so much for checking out this vlog remember to hit the subscribe button and i will see you guys in the next video